in Glasgow. I've got some bad news for you. I lost my suitcase. And I've reported to lost property that my suitcase is lost. Hopefully you hear back in 28 days. If we don't, well, I'm not going to get that dress back. Anyway, I'm going to head into town, get some clothes. The good thing is I'm only staying in Glasgow for one night only. I've got money with me, so I'm not that poor. I'm going to go and find some clothes and then get something to eat. Right now, it's like, what, 10 o'clock? Going to get a stitched t-shirt because I love stitch too much. Gear what size it is, I'm getting it. So, as you know, I lost my suitcase. So I just got a t-shirt, pants, socks, deodorant, shampoo, toothbrush, toothpaste. That's all you really need. And that costs 13 pounds from Primark. Thank you, Primark, for saving my life. So I'm just about to go and get some food. I see Enoch. Here we go. That is not cream, it's ice cream on top of a brownie. Okay, let's forget the bad news and let's focus on why I'm here. The reason why I'm here, tomorrow there's an alternative modeling competition going on, so I'm going to that. I've got a dress, so I'm gonna use that. It's red and black and I've got goggles. So that's what's happening tomorrow. That's why I'm here and I'm still going to it. I've got a hotel and hopefully during this one day, I'm going to see my friends. I'm just texting to see that I'm still meeting up with them. If not, I'm just going to the modeling competition. Hosted at the Royal Conservatoire, and I can't wait for tomorrow. It's gonna to be here. I can't believe it's this venue, and in about a few weeks' time, I'm gonna be here again for induction to stage management. I want to try it out. I have to go up this hill. Are you kidding me? Made it. Okay, so this is my number. I'm at the door. Just about to unlock it. I'm gonna see what's inside. Small. Wow, I have a sink and a TV. That's good. That, that's sorry. That's really good for thirty-eight pounds. A sink, a TV, <laughs> and a bed just for me. That's actually very good. Small, but not as small as I expected. This will do. I'm gonna rest now. Okay, in about 10 minutes, it's gonna be four o'clock. Until five o'clock, I'm gonna rest. Let me just show you the bathroom I'm sharing. So this is the bathroom that I'm sharing with people. There's a shower, sink, and toilet. Good thing there's a lock on it, so I can have some peace and quiet for like 10 minutes just to have a private shower. Oh, that's big. Just had a little nap, now I'm gonna go out and get something to eat. Even though I don't know what the time is because my phone is low so I left it off because I have no charger with me. All that was was in that suitcase was two dresses, some chargers and a wig. I'm not going to get a suitcase but I doubt they're going to find it. If I do, fingers crossed they find it. Oh, I love that dress back. But all I've got now for a dress for tomorrow for the alternative modern competition is this dress and a hat I just got. Just cost me £37, the hat cost me £12, and the goggles cost me £7. Alternative modelling competition for tomorrow. Wearing this dress. Ooh. I'll tell you this, not steady stairs. They, they feel like a little bit to the left. Thank you. Cheese and bacon.
70s. That pub I just went into was got too many Disney songs playing and too many Disney cocktails. I didn't have any, but I did have bacon, chips, and cheese. That was good. Thank you. I'm so glad I left this tiny little room and went to the hall and see what the crack was going on. It was really good that I went. I met Beth, I met Chris, I had a drink of Honey Monster. It was really good shake, even though there was a bit of vodka in it. Didn't feel at all. It was really good that I went. We talked about 50p coins, rock bands, what was studying. Like next year, I'm studying H&D Radio. If you didn't know that, I got into H&D Radio at City of Glasgow, so I can't wait to come back to Glasgow and study. And I can't wait to sometimes meet Beth again and again and again. And it's good to speaking to Chris. Also, we talked about like we should do snowboarding. She knows how to surf. That's, that's so cool. And then later on, we played Jenga, which is this game where you have these blocks that. You, that make a tower and you got to take the blocks out and then you have to put them on top Beth didn't know you had to put the blocks on top that's what you got to do she just took it out and just left it there no no you put them on top and it gets higher and higher and higher and it crashes down and when it crashes down you lose yeah Chris you lose you just saw us playing it Chris lost and we didn't play a game after that we left out of that it was 10 o'clock she went to get a taxi, he went to get his taxi, and now I'm here in my hotel, going to sleep, naked, due to the fact I've lost my suitcase, and there was pyjamas in it. I have no pyjamas, so I'm going to sleep naked. Anyway, I'm going to head to bed, 
because tomorrow is the alternative modeling competition. Can't wait. I'm going to wear alternative clothes, a red dress, top hat with goggles on it. Hopefully you like the dress if you've seen it. And if you haven't, check out vlog 20 and you'll see the alternative modeling competition with me, Danger Debs. Anyway, this has actually have been me, Danger Debs, the opposite of danger. I'm heading off to bed. Give this video a thumbs up, comment below and subscribe. This has been Danger Debs, the opposite of danger.